you can see I've got quite a few um, Veglia rev counters apart on the bench here and these were all non-working ones from my my stock um, in the little red pot is a parts only unit that's actually got a broken shaft so that's possibly not fixable um, that's kind of uh, watch making uh, repair level the uh, unit up at the top is the one that I've actually repaired and is now just awaiting um, a new bezel fitting and down the bottom here um, three of the mechanisms one dismantled uh, this one the circuit board is non-functional and the uh, coil had a break in it and if I zoom in here and you might just better see there's a connection here and a connection here and if you use a, an ohm meter or the ohm function on your multimeter between those two terminals you should get somewhere between maybe 140 and 180 ohms they've been averaging about 160 sometimes a bit lower and uh, that shows you that the the operating coil is intact and it is on on these two but this one's got a break in the coil um, one of them I was able to repair that coil uh, some of them it may need new coils winding which is quite a tricky operation but in any case if you've got one of these uh, electronic vaguely rev counters uh, you may want to just check whether it's um, it's functional so I'll clear things out the way and set up a working rev counter and show you a method of bench testing okay so obviously we're looking at the uh, the back of the tachometer on the right is a 12 volt transformer which I borrowed out of a uh, little halogen work light so anything that outputs around 12 volts AC um, size of the transformer doesn't really matter um, ideally uh, you'd fuse uh, the output just in case you shorted it out but if we have a look at the back of the tachometer this one's actually quite clearly marked so you can see on the left a plus symbol for the middle terminal there's a little earth symbol and the terminal on the right with the yellow wire running to it has got a one so the polarity from the uh, transformer doesn't cause matter because it's AC I've got a bench supply set up for 12 volts. You can see the output is uh, off at the moment. So we'll connect up the negative side and the positive and carefully turn it over. Now run the power supply on and plug in the 12 volt transformer and it should give a reading of 6000 RPM so you can see this one's really quite a bit optimistic and uh, I'm going to be replacing the bezel on this one at some stage so I can, uh, there is a trimmer pot inside and I can tweak that down to something less over optimistic. But that's a, uh, a simple means of bench checking one of these electronic Veglia tachometers.